Hi guys, welcome to another video and this is going to be focusing on my December slash Christmas PR kit from the Door Capranic Girls, which is Leanne. I have to apologise about my very creaky chair. Um, so that's what you can hear creaking in the background. Um, also, just before we get into this, I have decided... Um, that next year I'm going to get back into my YouTube properly. I'm going to be doing more unboxings, more hauls um, and weekly plan with me's. And my weekly plan with me's are hopefully going to be consisting of um, home planning, um, forward planning, uh, fitness and health and well-being and financial planning. Um, so... Fingers crossed, it's going to work. Um, we have lots of planners lined up. I'll also be doing a video shortly when all my planners are here um, of my 2020 setup. So first of all then, this is gorgeous. So I'm in a Hobonichi Weeks and this is it at the moment. Let me grab it. Oh God, it's full of bits and pieces that I've just carried upstairs. So this is it at the moment, and you can see it is well used. Um, so yeah, and we are going into another one. Let me just zoom out. We are going into another one next year, and this is it so far. And I've had so much fun setting this up. Um, yeah um if anybody knows <clears throat> anywhere that i can get like these note pages different ones um hook me up i really need some um i need like savings ones weight loss ones things like that uh, movies series things like that goals so we need some of those so here we go pr kit so, Leanne knows that I'm in a Hobonichi. I absolutely love a Hobonichi and I'm going to continue in one next year. But my next year's one is going to consist of forward planning. Because it's small to hand and it's got everything in. Okay, now where do we start? So let's start with this. Um, this <clears throat> is from Little Inky Heart. She's obviously done a collab with them. Handmade Planner and journal accessories and it's quite cute i'm getting there i'm preferring tinier clips i don't know why um when i first started i was into like the massive clips also um i haven't set up a christmas planner this year just because life but next year i will be um with lots of christmas supplies so it's really cute it has let me just zoom in zoom in so it has this little glitter bubble. It has snowflake and then it has like, if I can get it, a little gem. It just passes you. And it's quite cute and it's all different colours as well, which is interesting. So it's like a rose gold clip and then there's some silver and gold on there. It's quite cute. I like it. And then a rubber. Can never be without a rubber. I very much guess my daughter will come and swipe that at some point because she's into planning now. We have a candy cane pen, which I tried and I believe it was blue and it writes quite nice. Yeah, I will most likely take this to work. We are paperless at work, but sometimes we do require to write something down. Uh, I can use this for my notes and it's quite Christmassy. So that will go nice. Okay, and then Leanne also makes her own paper clips. And I do actually like this because I like the sayings on it, stress, blessed and Christmas obsessed. And I think that's a very good quote that sums up Christmas for most people. <laughs> um, so yeah, love that. Um, they're very, very well made from Leanne. Let me just get it out of the packaging. 
they are very very well made you can see sometimes when you get some of these they fall apart but I've never had one of Leanne's fall apart and I had one that she sent me a long time ago that was a today and literally I used it for a good six months in my planner and it still looks as good as it did back then so these are brilliant and if this is too big to be used as like an actual paper clip, what you could do, I don't have one in here, um, but if like you had like anything that had got a pocket in, you can just put it there as almost like a die cut, which is probably what I would use it for. Just as a decoration. Okay, more to the point. Stickers, we love stickers. I'm going to zoom out. Okay, so... In my house, we are doing Elf on the Shelf. These are great to write down what, how to, where to put your elf for the day. So we've done Elf, Naughty Elf Poos in the Potty, Naughty Elf Ties Up Good Elf, and then we've had Good Elf on a Reindeer. So these are good to write down in your planner so then you know when your child's gone to bed how to arrange your elf. Love it. Love these. They're brilliant. I love Elf on the Shelf. I had some last year, and I don't know what I did with them. Elf on the Shelf ones. And then we have some little Christmas penguins. Again, I love them. These are brilliant. I love this one. Date night. Um, and then you can use these to just mark things. So, like, if you're going to give Christmas gifts, snowman, see Santa, sort your Christmas stockings out... I'd use these as just to mark appointments and things. Christmas jumper day, Christmas lights, or Christmas decorations. Yeah, they're fab. I love them. And Leanne's upgraded her paper. Paper's brilliant. I love, love, love the new paper. Don't change it. It's the best. <laughs> okay, and then Hobonichi kits. Now, I love, love Hobonichi. Um, I don't know why. I never thought I would be in to Hobonichi and then my friend Karen gifted mine last year to me and I've converted converted love them so this is the making spirits bright now with Christmas kits I love Christmas kits to be traditional and Christmassy um that's my main trend that I sway towards if I sway to anything that's a little bit different um, it has to be quite, like, unique for me to go for it. Like, I have a pastel one at the moment, but um, it's got, like, a gingerbread tree, like, gingerbread house as a one-sheeter. But nine times out of ten, I will steer towards traditional like this. So, we start off with our dates, covers. And then this strip I normally put on the opposite side just to segregate it off. And then these are top and bottom washes. And I love them. I absolutely love them. So traditional. Then we have our boxes. And some headers. And I love that you get a good amount of boxes in here. But you know what my favourite sheet is? It's this one. Because it's full of build juice, habit trackers, loads of icons. I often find when you get kits, there's not enough icons. Or you get pointless icons that you would never use. And I just... Yeah, but I love these ones as well, the words and the icons. I use these a lot. Um, so obviously laundry day is definitely used every week. Meal plan, grocery, um, sometimes takeaway, cleaning, uh, bin day, payday. And then the ones that I don't use, I've bought one of those um, like reusable sticker books and I pop them in. And then they come in useful somewhere else down the line, so you don't you don't waste uh, weekend banner. And then checklists, love them. And then this is a bonus sheet, and I've seen this one sticker on it, love it. So you get more boxes. Again, Christmas week is going to be mega. But you know what? If you had some Christmas washi which I do, I have this one that was out of an advent calendar box that would team with this perfectly. You could easily stretch one of Leanne's kits much further than just a week. So, so seriously, you could. Um, so you get more check boxes and then you get this. Look at this. Be good or I will text Santa. I love that. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. That is just, yeah. So... 
I am going to link down below her website and Etsy. And if you place an order with Leanne and use the code Kelly10, you get 10% off plus some extra freebies. So this is great for Hobonichis. And I actually prefer Hobonichis at the moment because the kits in general are much, much cheaper than like an Erin Condren kit. And it's just, I just find it so versatile. Loads of people have jumped onto the Hobonichi bandwagon. Um, so in the kit, we had the full Hobonichi Making Spirits Bright with the bonus page, a candy cane pen that I love, the little gingerbread man rubber, a paper clip, which again, love it. And I love that it's all Christmassy. And then what have I done with the paper clip that she's given me? I've lost it. Oh no, what have I done with that? Ah. Within two minutes, I've lost something. And then you get your Christmas penguins, your elf antics. And let me just see if I can find what I have just done with that paper clip. It was literally here. Is it falling on the floor? Yes. It's falling on the floor, let me get it. And this. So I think that is perfect for Christmas. So yeah, any comments or any suggestions for what you would like to see from me in 2020, um, stay tuned. Tomorrow, I have an exciting delivery that I think Kaz asked me to do an unboxing video on and I'm sure going to be doing it. Um, and it was the Happy Planner mystery bag that I managed to snag one for $34.99. And it's got about $150 worth of goodies in it. I've seen an unboxing of it. I personally think it's absolutely amazing. Uh, some people weren't impressed. I don't understand why. I will be doing an unboxing of that tomorrow. Um, plus any hauls and stuff that are coming my way. I will be doing shortly. Thank you for watching. Leave your comments down below. And I will link everything in the comments below for you to make orders with Leanne. Thank you.